So Dave Bautista, for people who don't remember, back in October 2020, he was yeah. he was showing for Biden Harris, and he was advocating obviously for big government on gun control. Yeah. Okay, so this is him then, where he said, "My fellow gun owners, Joe Biden is pro Second Amendment. He wants gun reform, a ban on assault rifles, and a voluntary buyback of assault rifles owned." I won't even get into the fact that he probably doesn't know what an assault rifle is. He Correct. thinks it's a laser blaster from Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> this is Pew-pew. fair. This was save lives. I don't need to overcompensate with an AR-15. Oh Lord, your right to bear arms. Okay, first off, here's something. Let me just address, and we'll get to we'll get to the point of this because now he's complaining about something that he didn't foresee. <laughs> when people say I don't need to compensate with an AR-15, every guy in a wheelchair has a small dick. Mm. <laughs> Every woman is compensating to avoid being gang raped in uh, Inglewood, California. It's the stupidest. Art. You know who carries more than any? UFC champions? We've had them on yeah. it. We've Boss Rutten talked about this. He said yeah. everyone wants to pull up and pull up and test us. He said, "Really, in the street? Of course, I'm not going to fight somebody. It's a liability. I'm only yeah. going to defend myself with a firearm." You, no matter how tough you are, are not tougher than either multiple attackers or an attacker with a weapon. It's not compensating. Right? It's not compensating like taking steroids and going out there and telling everyone how tough you are. It's especially important for women, for people who may not be able to afford the, the Anavar dosage that you do. Exactly. Why would you take one of the most effective firearms and say no because it's so effective? Isn't that the point? Yeah. I have <laughs> I no that choice. Was the whole goal. That maybe yeah. that was them with a the vaccine. Yeah. They had a version like, nah, it's too, it works too well. You, let's I, do birdshot for everybody just so you can piss your attacker off further. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You can fill birdshot with coins though i found out in a tom hanks movie <laughs> really and yeah you kill yes. somebody well yes. don't fire that in the News wrong the area of uh, hollywood with all the no just just like fire the ground. look run this is what's ironic because he's saying you can be safe with a voluntary buyback well yeah. he wanted to make uh, uh beto his guns are who said it's mm-hmm. a mandatory gun back like australia but right. here's the thing the issue right is once you give government control look at the assault weapons ban of 94 it became nothing but bureaucratic red tape yeah. this was legal pistol grip illegal just little cosmetic differences to try and make it hard for gun manufacturers and mom and pop shops to be able to provide you with the means to defend yourself. The main issue is A, it's an infringement of our rights, but it also creates another big government bureaucracy who, of course, used this power to infringe on your rights. Batista didn't see that coming. And now, I think this went up just this weekend, he's pissed about big government red tape and regulations. Here's Batista now. I have a riddle. I have a riddle. It's, it's a mystery and I need help with. I can't figure it out. How many bureaucrats does it take to grant an awful citizen of Tampa like myself he just called himself an awful power. citizen <laughs> but I'm dealing with people who have meetings to set other meetings I'm dealing with people who give me a list of stuff to do just so I can take to them so they can give me another list of stuff to do it's called government I spent thousands of dollars on permits I spent 40 grand last week on a, a wire what the f- do I have to do to get power from the city of Tampa? Well, first oh. off, you should learn what a riddle is. Um, <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's like, hey, would you like to? Yeah, I like riddles. Is that the guy? What from- did I eat for breakfast? I don't know. Eggs. Well, I don't know. That's, 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 they don't bury survivors. I don't know how to handle this riddle. riddle question. That's not, just a statement. This that's is the more, guy. That's the guy from Stuber. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. The guy from Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh. Yeah, 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 that hit film. The Stuber. awful citizen, as he said. How would it take for an awful citizen? Did you yeah. mean to say lawful citizen? But look, look. <laughs> awful scripts. <laughs> yeah, awful scripts, awful wrestling. Acting. Awful I just to double check that it was the guy I thought it was who I hate. Go yes, on. Yes, no, you're absolutely right. Wow, he's awful. We, he, this is the same guy who doesn't need a gun to compensate. Yeah. Okay. Well, look. Well, okay. You don't. Why do you need gen, Why do you need generators? Right. Why mm-hmm. just no. Swiss Family Robinson that shit? Do it yeah. yourself. Get on a pedal. Right. Why? Why do you need this for power? These are tools, just like firearms. These are tools to make your life safer, to make your life more efficient. And I agree with you. You shouldn't be having to deal with a bunch of bureaucratic red tape if it's on your own property. Hey, look, you can come over and join our side. You just can't decide when it's convenient for you that my wife, coming out of, let's say, surgery in a wheelchair, doesn't have the right to have an assault rifle, which, by the way, would include the Walther PDP with over 10-round magazines. Well, yes. It would be illegal because of the magazine ban. So let's just, let's just, be, consider- let's just be consistent about it awful citizen watch louder with crowder live monday through thursday 10 a.m eastern